Anyway, um, <laughs> anyway, that was the ice cream truck going by. Hey guys, it's Sim Queen, and this is part 68 of the 100 Baby Challenge. So I have invited Makoa over, and we've already started the flirting process, because right now Jenna is not pregnant, which just, that will not do. We, she cannot be not pregnant. So we're going to kiss hands, and do a sexy pose, as much as we possibly can, because um, we need to get ready to have baby number 46. All the kids are in here either playing or sleeping, which is fine by me. Um, let's do blow a kiss and first kiss. I think that's really all we need to do. We're going to see if we can woohoo in the uh, money pile. That's oh, we can't yet. That's our next location. Um, so for the woohoo challenge, basically uh, I've said it a million times, but if you're just starting the series now, um, we are trying to woohoo in... Oh, hold on. He just got mad at us? Why? That was weird. Is the maid jealous? Well, I mean, who can blame him? Um, we're trying to woohoo in every single possible location, and we have like four left, so let's go kiss his neck. That should do the trick. <laughs> that should definitely do the trick. Uh, I'm going to get the girls both to do their homework. Also, I hear something broken up here. What's broken? The toilet. We'll replace that. Yeah, I don't know why, but that was weird. He suddenly got angry at her for something, and I don't know what it was, but he seems to have gotten over it. I mean, it looks like they're getting pretty cozy. Can we not woohoo in this pile? There we go. Try for baby with Makoa. So that would knock off another one off our list. Then we just have the rocket ship, leaf pile, and lighthouse, I believe. Oh, and the coffin. Okay, we have more than I thought. Um, are these kids are just fine, I'm hoping. Yeah, I mean, they're hungry, but I don't know if I have time to feed them. <laughs> well, I mean, I can feed them, but, like, to make food, I don't know if I have time for that. Let's just get them all to eat some food. Let's see, are you going to move in this money pile? Oh, good. I kind of wanted to see this. I don't know that I've actually seen this interaction before, but we're going to see how it goes. Oh, it looks kind of fun. Oh, my God. It's basically what I expected. <laughs> you can hear the cash falling to the ground. Okay, so that's an obnoxious way to make a baby, but that's fine. Um, so both the girls are doing really good. Let's actually get this one up. And you can grab some food as well. Then Jenna. When this is done, I gotta make sure she's actually pregnant. Come on. Oh, and also baby Herbert is crying. Uh, let's... Just get out. There we go. Okay, let's see if she's pregnant. MC pregnancy. It's a boy. Okay, good. She is pregnant. Makoa can leave. We're done with him. We'll go take care of baby Herbert and then go take a pregnancy test. Oh my god, who's this? Vera Wang. Oh, Vera Wang is here. Okay, well, you know, we actually don't permit our kids to come back and visit. Once you've left, you don't get to come back inside. So that's that. And then you can grab some of this. Oh, clean up. Oh, it's empty. Oh. Okay. What's going on with all these little kids? What's his problem? Where's your food? They're, the kids are doing that annoying thing again where they don't want to eat. Eating for two. Oh, okay. That was pretty quick. Um, so she's also really tired. Now, the question is, do I do anything about it? Oh, wait, she needs a bath. Go take a shower. I'm trying to get all these kids fed. You know, you are supposed to be eating this soup. What's this one doing? That one's pretty much fine. I'm going to get her to play dolls just for a little bit before she goes back to bed. Um, okay, so for the older kids, it looks like um, Cecilia is eating. So once she gets... Oh, she's good. She's good to go. Okay, so Cecilia will be a teenager tomorrow. And then as for Devin, she has to get to level 4 in order to get a B in something. Okay. There's no food left for this kid either. Here, go have a ham and cheese sandwich. Oh my god, there's just so much to do. Is this kid going to eat her soup? I mean, I doubt it. 
Okay, so she has showered. Good, you can go to sleep. Frederick just got to level three in the communication skill, so that is good. Um, he's actually almost ready to age up, or at least getting there. Um, those skills are all pretty close. And then Emily is about the same, so that's good. That's good to know. Cecilia is going to a phase. Oh, this one just reached level three for imagination. Okay, um, you can all just go to sleep because they're in terrible moods. Oh my god. And then this one. Oh, she did her homework already. Maybe she could keep playing dolls. I don't even know. I don't even know what I should be doing right now. I do know that we need to work on building the rocket ship at some point because that'll be our next woohoo location. I expect there's food everywhere. I feel like some of them just get yeah, like this one didn't even eat. That is so annoying. It's like they're not even grateful. This one is like, no, no. She's just doing dishes, which, you know what, mostly I appreciate that, but right now, there are better things you could do with your time. Go, uh, go to sleep. There we go. Creativity level three, that's good. Um, I'm probably gonna get Frederick up to finish some food. Oh, those pancakes were gonna be my first option, but never mind. You know what, just forget it. Just go to bed. I've had it with all these kids. I am so done. So our next baby is going to be a G-H-I. Letter I of the alphabet and the last name will be Kiloha. I believe that's Makoa's last name. Or first, wow. Yes, Makoa's last name. Akito is calling. Inviting us to a charity event, I believe, but no, we're not doing that. I've been down that road before. All you do is donate money to their event and you get nothing in return. So, no thank you. <laughs> that's like, that's pretty much exactly what donating is. Okay, so, um, oh yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Go, uh, superficient baby care. Go to sleep. We don't need to get up at 2.30 in the morning. There's just, that's just totally unnecessary. Also, we did buy a lottery ticket in the last part, but we did not win. I started recording after the winner was announced. It was, um, like Christian Delgado or something like that. I don't know. wasn't, it wasn't us, so I don't really care. I guess she should probably get up kind of soon. Yeah, let's just get her up. Because there's like, we have run out of food. That's the problem. Um, okay, let's go and serve um, French toast, I guess. That's for all the kids. This one's going to eat rotten pancakes. I don't know how I feel about that. I don't think you should do that. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. Oh, this one was already in the shower. I always do that. I just click on a sim and cancel whatever they're doing, not realizing that it might be something I actually want them to do. Um, you, oh my god, this kid is like starving. Make him food now. <sighs> well, I'm officially stressed out. It's a good thing Cecilia is becoming a teenager today because I could really use her help around here. She's just gonna eat these rotten pancakes. No, don't, don't do it. Clean the plates up. Okay, you gotta hurry up with this French toast because if Fred gets taken away, we will have failed the challenge. I will not fail at 45 kids. I will not. Okay, Fred, just hold on. It's coming. Get your French toes. There you go. Okay, all, all the toddlers can grab food now. You know what? This wouldn't be an issue if the toddlers would just um, eat their entire meal and not put it down and go to sleep. There we go. Fred should be good now. Everyone's got their food. Cecilia's doing some dishes. She doesn't really have to. We do have the maid, but I don't, I'm just trying to fill up her time with something. There we go. Okay, so Jenna, let's, um, first of all, let's go get our mail, and then we'll come out here and work on the rocket ship, because once that's built, we can have, we can woohoo in the rocket ship. Um, both of them are doing fine. You're eating. I guess I have to, like, make sure the toddlers actually eat something. Okay. I hear the ice cream truck coming. You know what? I'm totally not going to shut my door because I want everyone to experience the joy. Also, that reminds me. Wasn't there a Sims? There, I'm sure there's a Sims game where we had ice cream trucks. Maybe it's Sims 3, but I can envision, like, clicking on it and then ch there's, like, a bunch of things you can choose. This is very exciting for me. My dog's going to freak out because, I mean, he thinks he's getting ice cream, but... Let's just listen to the joyous music. So obnoxious and creepy. Oh, 
Anyway, um, <laughs> anyway, that was the ice cream truck going by. For some reason, I felt like everyone needed to be part of that. Um, I remember the ice cream truck got me so excited when I was little, and now I'm just like, I don't know. I don't know about all that. Uh, can you go play some dolls, please? It's still going. And my dog didn't freak out. He kind of just let them go. Um, so this one, she looks mad because she's not being included in playtime, which is kind of sad. You go watch a toddler video. You don't need them. Okay, both of you should be going to school. You're both going to study hard. Jenna, nowhere near done this thing, which is fine. It takes a while to build it. We still have other places we can woohoo. It's a build, it's a work in progress. We don't have to build it all today. Um, let's go and give some of these kids a bath because they're like downright disgusting. Let's um, start with Fred, give him a bath. Emily, what are you up to? You gotta age up today, like there's no way around it. Uh, let's work on your thinking skill, I think. Where's the other tablet? There we go, go play Sim Shape. You gotta age up today, like this is taking way too long. Her natural birthday, Oh my god, it's already her natural birthday. That's how long that took. Which best means it's Fred's birthday too. It is. Okay, you know what? We're aging them up because those are the rules. You have to either wait until they all have level 3 in all their skills or until their natural birthday. So, whatever comes first. So here we are. We're going to age up Emily and Fred. They're not very smart kids because they might be the first ones. I'm not sure. But they might be the first ones that we've had to do this with. Come on! What the hell is it? Oh, it's because she's on the stupid tablet. Oh my god. You know what, and, and like, Herbert is freaking out. I'm sorry, Herbert, you don't deserve this. Just forget it. Forget about Emily, she's stupid anyway. There you go. Okay, Herbert's happy now. Um, maybe now we'll try aging Emily up. Where is she? Okay, get off the tablet. I know it's my fault that I got her to, to play with the tablet. Also, we should turn the AC on because we're having a heat wave today and the kids are getting uncomfortable. Okay, let's... Uh, oh, let's put this French toast away, too. Oh my god, are you serious? We still cannot age her up? Gloria, what are you up to? Oh my good god, she's stinky. Okay. Okay, hold on. First things first. My first priority is getting these kids to age up, so... I can still hear the ice cream truck. I don't know about you, but I think they're coming back. Octavia Bailey Moon is calling. Key, okay, you know what? I'm starting to lose my mind a little bit. Let's reset both of these. Yeah, there we go. Try this again. Age up, Emily. Come on. Oh, someone's dead. Uh, Avril. Oh. Avril died. I don't think that was her Villa Real. Villa Real. I don't know if that was her real name or like her maiden name, I guess, or if she changed it and maybe got married. I don't know. Let's add birthday candles to that. Uh, so you got neat. Okay, I'm fine with that. I don't really care. Uh, just randomizing all of their traits. So that's Emily. Thank you for being such an annoying child. I already don't like her. Um, let's also eat up bread. Then we got a bath, um, Gloria, because, like, man, she stinks. <laughs> Poor Gloria, she doesn't deserve this. All the other kids are put on the back burner because Fred and Emily are so high maintenance. This kid's outgoing. Okay, well, good for you. We'll give Gloria a bath, and I'm also going to get them to add birthday candles to this so that when Cecilia gets home, she can age up as well. Did you just break the fridge? She did it. It was her. I, I watched her do it. You know what? <sighs> I hate you. Oh, you look like you're tired. That's great. Let's go to sleep. Go to bed, Fred. There you go. Okay. So, yeah, she's going to give Gloria a bath, and then I guess we should probably potty train her. I think that's the next thing we have to do, and apparently fix our fridge. I'm just going to replace it, though, honestly. There we go. Okay. Potty train Gloria. And, oh, Cecilia, uh, did you did you get an A? Yes, you did. Good. Come blow out your candles. So many birthdays. This is what I like to see. Progress. The last part didn't feel like there was much happening, but this feels a lot better. Okay, so loves the outdoors and she's a cat lover. You're going to get the, um, the animal treat, I think. There we go. Add more candles to that. 
Ooh, nice outfit. I'm digging the hat. Is that like a hat with fishing lures on it? Yes, it is. Oh my god, she has a fishing hat. I, I kind of like it. She looks great. Okay, so your job is going to be to make food for the family. Please don't burn the house down. That's all I ask. I may have to shut my door because the music from the ice cream truck has just officially become obnoxious. Okay, so we're potty training Gloria, and then what else? What other traits do we have to do? Um, we could do communication, imagination, movement. Yeah, you can go play Luck Block Baby after this. You know what, one toddler, I can t already tell things are going to get better. It, things are looking up because we only have one toddler, and that is how I like things to be. You can go take a bath after this. Oh, you actually successfully made mac and cheese. Wow. Okay, I expected her to burn the house down, and she did not. You actually you can go eat. There we go. Wow. Okay, good job. I guess um, she's the new cook of the family. But that works because we can get her skill to level 4, whatever it is she needs to get her grades up. That works just fine. Grab a serving. And I forgot to turn the AC on here. You can do that. To cooler. And then what can you do for fun? I think I'll just get her to go upstairs and play some video games on the computer. I don't really care. Also, I keep looking at our graveyard thinking, like, it's so sad. We haven't killed anyone in such a long time. We should definitely add to this. Like, who could we kill? There's got to be someone. I want to boy you. I don't even know who you are. Oh my god, everybody keeps breaking stuff. And I swear it's on purpose. There you go. Now you can stack the blocks. I apologize if all you hear in the background of this video is the ice cream truck, but honestly, it is so hot, I kind of, I need this. I need the ice cream truck. Okay, so she needs to have some fun. Um, you can just go watch TV. There we go. We're doing good. Everyone's doing fine. Um, oh, she's gonna eat. Fred, he's, Fred's good. I mean, it's Friday, so, like, there's no rush on doing homework, really. They can just do it whenever. Um, oh, Gloria, you can go to bed. As I say, there's no rush. I still make them do their homework. Um, okay, what are you doing? You need to go play dolls, yes. I'm gonna put this in the fridge. And then this kid can go to sleep. I think... Oh, I think we're actually doing pretty good. I I don't know why I'm always surprised by that. I'm always shocked when things are going well. Um, then you have been upgraded or downgraded, I'm not sure, to the basement, and baby Herbert is crying. Hold on, is it Herbert's birthday? It might be Herbert's birthday. No, tomorrow. Okay, we're good. Okay, we're going to go take care of Herbert and then go to sleep. That kid is so tired. Oh my god. Well, I did make her go to bed. She should be fine, but you know, kids in this game, they complain about literally everything. You can go to sleep. There we go. I think we're doing pretty good. Gonna turn off lights. Okay, so everyone is in bed. Good. Everyone's asleep. That is the way I like it. So I want to see where Devin is. Um, she'll probably get an A on Monday when she goes to school. But that'll be the next part. But still, we're doing pretty good. Gloria still has a bit of work to do, but I can't believe how slow Emily and Frederick were to build their skills. That seems a little bit unusual. We should check on Jenna's age, too. Five days still. We're doing good. You know what? I think I may be able to pull off this whole woohoo challenge. I was thinking she might age up before we can complete it, but so far, we're doing pretty good. I don't want any of the kids to wake up before, like, 5.30 or 6, but we'll see how it goes. Um, oh, good. 6 o'clock. Okay, you can get up, go to the washroom, take a shower. I don't care what anybody else does, really. Gloria. Oh, yes, you can get up. Oh, no, Gloria needs food, like, now. Uh, let's just put this French toast right here, and you can just go eat that. Some of the toddlers wake up, and they are so ravenously hungry, like, they have to eat right this moment. 
Let's age up um, Herbert and see what he turns out like. And he already got birthday gifts. <laughs> that did not take long. Okay, so he got the fussy trait. Well, why not? You know what? Just You can join the rest of them. They're all pretty fussy, I think. You can go play some shape on the tablet. There you go. What are you paranoid about? Oh my god. Everybody is so miserable right now. Um, also, when is this baby coming? I do want to check on that. Oh, not for a while. So it'll be the next part, probably, that we have this baby. You can go grab a serving of that. Good, so she's eating food and filling her diaper, so she did not make it to the bathroom, which is unfortunate. But that's also just the way it goes. Uh, we could get her to work on um, her thinking skill. Oh, 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 I thought this kid was eating. Okay, you're going to serve some food. Serve, uh, no, I don't care about this. Serve eggs and toast. Again, everyone is so grumpy. It's just the story of my life. Um, let's also come over here and do some flashcards. We'll do teach basic needs. I'll do it twice because I can almost guarantee the first time just won't work. <laughs> oh, of course, this time it's going to work. Yeah, for some reason, when you do flashcards, they ignore the first one. Like, no. Oh, see? It happened. It happened. Fire. What? Where? Oh my god, that was creepy. Gloria predicted the fire before it even happened. She's psychic. And she's still cooking. You know what? You, you can't cook through the fire. Oh, for the love of God. Put yourself out, you mess. <sighs> this was discussed. I said no fires. Please. That was weird, though. Gloria was reacting to the fire before it even happened. Okay, you know what? Everyone's fine. No, no. No reason to be upset. You'll be, you'll be fine. Oh my god, she actually carried one of her children away from the fire. I didn't know Jenna had maternal instincts. That's not normal. Okay, let's, um, do, do some flashcards outside. How about that? Oh my god, look at this nerdy little kid. Oh my god, I love her glasses. Oh, I love her glasses. I just, I like everything about her, honestly. Um, anyway, so yeah, I just wanted to make fun of her just for a quick minute. So, you... Eat macaroni and cheese. Well, I guess you have to, because you burnt what you were making before. Okay, so go take a shower. Um, I'm not sure what else I can even do. This, that one, I mean, she's hungry, but... <sighs> All these kids are just stressing me out. Is this one getting... Okay, the fire is done. It's over. You have to get over it. Go teach her about animals. I don't know. Teach her about basic needs. Like how I need you to study your flashcards. And crying does not help. It'll get you nowhere. Oh my god. And then this one is hungry, I believe. Get some leftovers. Ah, you suck. This one needs a shower. I can't believe she set up fire. Le yesterday she made mac and cheese with so much ease it wasn't even funny and now all apparently she can't do that anymore that's just that's a lost skill more flashcards please i'm not done i am not done level two good that didn't take that long actually the flashcards seem to be very um effective especially with the thinking skill so that's good what are you doing oh, she's crying because she Yes. You know what? Yes. You, you started a fire, potentially ruined my life. It's true. But it's okay. Do your homework, and then do your project. Then you... Do they all have school projects? Oh, no, they don't. You can do the extra credit work. <laughs> These kids. These poor kids. Um, he did his homework already. Clean up these dishes. Like, come on, you gotta earn your keep around here, and we can't have the house looking like this, so do something about it. What's this one up to? This one, you know what, is not that bad. A Herbert is, has so far been a pretty easy kid to get along with, and I really do appreciate that. Uh, for Gloria's skills, we're at two for just about all of them. Well, no, except for imagination. So we're doing pretty good. 
It's a very nice day. You know what? We, we never bring our kids outside. It's almost like we don't even want them to experience life outside of the home. Like, they only leave to go to school. And, I mean, I thought about, like, taking them all to the beach, but then I was like, why would I do that to myself? Like, that just sounds like a terrible day. Okay, you know what? Let's get the mail. Gloria, um, you can use the potty. Work on that skill for a bit. And then, Jenna, you can go continue building the rocket ship. I don't know why we still have the chicken coop. Oh my god, the freaking ice cream truck is coming back. Nobody wants ice cream, go away. You know what, I should just, just let you guys enjoy this. Yeah, mm -hmm. just, I mean, right now it's like 33 degrees, and I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit, that's, I have no idea, um, close to 100, I would say, and, you know, it's a nice summer day, but, uh, I don't know, I just, I don't know, I don't like ice cream trucks. Okay, so you, uh, can come eat this food. Gloria, what are you stamping your foot about? Get over it. Um, you can work on shapes. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Some of the kids have low social, but I mean, come on. Like, that's not a real need. You don't need to talk to people. Like, you're just fine. Okay, so, um, when she is done her school project, maybe I'll get her to make some food. I want her to get her cooking skill up so that she no longer lights our house on fire. That would be, like, super nice if she could do that. Let's do, um, franks and beans. That sounds good. This kid needs a nap. And this kid just needs to go to sleep. It's like 5 p.m. and he is ready to go to bed. I do feel that. I really do. You're working on your rocket ship. That will probably be done in the next part. I think this will be our next Woohoo location. Because the leaf pile, we have to wait until fall anyway. Which is... Oh, tomorrow. It starts tomorrow. Okay. Maybe, maybe that'll be our next location. Here, come home and take a shower. Ooh, look at that. She didn't burn the food. That's impressive. Good job. Sims rarely start more than one fire. Like, usually they just, they keep it to a reasonable amount. Grab a serving. Oh, did someone else die? Oh, someone else has died. Who is it now? Roxanne. What? Did we have a kidney, Roxanne? I don't think we did. Oh my god, I don't even know. I don't remember naming a kid Roxanne. Hold on, this didn't happen. Um, I have a list of all the names, so I'm just going to look at my list. It's probably faster than looking at this messed up family tree that we have. Um, we don't have a Roxanne on this list. Don't know who that is. It might be a grandchild, but either way, let's just look at this family tree for a sec. Let's just look at this. Um, so the top row here, all these people, those are all of our kids, and we are at 45. And then this second row is all of our grandkids. It looks like we have about 12, 13, 14, about 15, 20, like 23-ish. And then the bottom row is our great grandkids. And there's not that many, just like, just one? We have one great grandkid? Don't, wait, hold on. Why the hell? This isn't right. This isn't right at all. Why is Devin down here as like a great grandkid? What the heck? It's not recognizing Devin's mo mother is... Oh, yes it is. Okay, whoa. I'm sorry, this family's tree is so messed up, I can't even make sense of it. I really can't... There is actually... Okay, so hold on. Let's look at, the... Let's look at it this way. Here's Jenna. And then all of her kids. I'm looking... For... Devin Rosenberg. Oh my god, there's two of them. And they look the exact same. What the hell is going on? What's happening? What... What? I don't even know what to say. Oh no, I think something gross happened. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, it's bad. Oh, it's bad. Devin's, Devin's dad. Oh no, I've done something horrible. Oh my god. We just, we just seriously messed things up. Okay, so, um, Gerald Rosenberg, the father of Devin Rosenberg, is actually Jenna's great-grandson. 
Oh my god, that's gross. I didn't know you could have kids with your great-grandson. I belong in prison. This is so gross. Oh, we really messed things up. We gotta be more careful. Um, that was a total accident, and it's pretty gross, and I'm quite disgusted with myself, but I didn't know. Why am I allowed to have a child with my great-grandson? That shouldn't be a thing. And then it also, like, Joe is your great-granddaughter. Oh, who's your dad? Grayson Flex. Oh, oh, it's bad. It's so bad. <laughs> okay, so you know what? I'm going to leave this part right here. I need some time to think about this. I have messed up this family tree so bad, and I've made it so gross, and just, it's just, you know what? This challenge is not a good idea. Don't ever do it. It gets pretty yucky after a while. But anyway, I'm going to leave this part right here. If you enjoyed this part, please give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.